VNL's Leisure Chronicles recently got invited to an important inauguration in Kalayaan Street in Makati. It wasn't so much the inauguration of a building that got us interested, but the significance of this welcome development in a particular industry. This building represents the employee's dormitory of a big Japanese IT company called K-Lab Scorpion that has set up its growing business in the Philippines. And today, they are inaugurating this building. Guest of honor at the event was attorney Darlene Berberabe, president and CEO of Pag-ibig Fund. K-Lab President and Chief Executive Officer Mr. Taro Noguchi share with us how and why the company had this novel idea of providing an employee's dormitory. The uh, first idea is came up two years ago and because of the, as you know, uh, uh, traffic in um, the city area is kind of terrible and also that uh, we sometimes face to like a problem with a natural disaster such as a typhoon. And there's so, so many times that you know we need to uh, suspend operation. So I'm keep on thinking what we can you know, any good solutions like you know not not employee to be like wasting times and not how the com company can continuously you know, operations. So yeah, I come up with the dormitory ideas, and but it takes two hour, two years yes to make it to companies. All employees can you know can stay here. And, uh, to, but some employees, uh, some are uh, living around here already, or some the parents does not want to, so, and yeah, for, but actually open for everyone. Mr. Vince Suiko, executive assistant to the president, was happy to elaborate on the unique employee benefit that the company is giving to its workforce. Well, this is uh, an employee dormitory. It's uh, undertaken by our management. Vince tells us that the management of K-Lab listens to its employees. And when they voice a need to have a halfway house, K-Lab says Scorpion leased out this building and set it up for a very neat and functional dormitory. Miss Olga de la Cruz gladly told us about these rooms and the other employee benefits that the company is giving to its workforce. Four bed room. Um, this is a smaller one and it has all furnishings inside and then the next one is also a four bed room but this one is a larger one and then we have the two bed room this uh, these rooms are all fully furnished but the two bed room being uh, a quite special one it has uh, two study tables within. We have our free shuttle service for our employees um, from from three points, okay? And then we have our free meals. And um, we, we normally give um, uh, medical allowance and other incentives to our employees. With free breakfast and lunch and free shuttle, as well as free housing, this has revolutionized the employees' benefits in this type of industry. Vince tells us more about their company. Their core competence is uh, creating apps for smartphones, games and apps for smartphones. Um, Club Japan, our headquarters, decided to outsource some of that game development and sound engineering here, so we have actual Filipino sound engineers and game developers who work on the games and then once once it is finished they send them back to our headquarters in Japan because the games and apps are for the Japanese market. In the pipeline possible for this year is the games and apps for the Philippine market. K-Lab Scorpion is a nine-year-old company here in the Philippines that is wholly Japanese-owned. It started with 20 employees in 2007 and now counts over 200 employees. Our vision and mission is, uh, cornerstone of it is the, the Japanese words of Sanpo Yoshi, which in English means all good. So um, we're trying to, to do all good for uh, Philippine society. It's a way of contributing um, to the society here through um, uh, giving employment opportunities to Filipinos and not just employment opportunities but housing opportunities as well. They have set up a 9 to 6 bed dormitory for their employees, specifically those who live in faraway places. Uh, as an IT company, you know, the most important asset is a human self, our employees. 
so the investment to you know to make it uh, uh, make some better environment for the employees. The definitely that it's going to be also the growing connect to the growing our companies. So and we still keep on recruiting, and we are very welcome that you know if someone see this one, please join you know our com our company. Yes. Well, we have um, we have vacancies now for game developers, sound engineers, uh, for trainees as well. So anybody out there, the viewers of Business and Leisure, if you're interested in game development, sound engineering, if you're a fresh graduate, please come and see us uh, at the C2 building, third floor, uh, Bonifacio High Street. Well, uh, we encourage other employers out there, uh, at least within our industry, the game development inter industry, to, uh, to emulate what uh, we have tried to set here and to provide uh, housing for, for your employees. Your people are your greatest asset, and it's a form of uh, corporate social responsibility, and uh, it'll make them happy. A happy workforce is a productive workforce. This is a very valued um, privilege and benefit given to your employees. Po. It, it makes them really, really productive because they are really inspired to work. And as you know, a productive um, worker or employee will produce a successful company and would in turn produce a successful Philippine.